Sporting more guns and a limited edition livery, the C8X Pisces Expedition turns the Stout Snub into a perfectly viable standalone exploration vessel. With its compact frame, deft maneuverability, and seating for three, the Pisces Expedition is ready to take on its own adventures. Welcome, Immortals, I'm Vici Deum, here to go over the top five best uses for the Anvil C8X Pisces. But don't forget to sub up since we're starting right now. Number 5. Piracy Criminals come in all shapes and sizes. The tools they use are just as unique. When you need a small ship for committing your capers, look no further. The C8X Pisces is a great choice for any players interested in entering piracy or rounding out their criminal enterprise. With a versatile, small form factor vessel, the Pisces excels in this role by offering a convenient design perfect for solo players or complementing a pirate carrier as its runabout, capable of launching from a hangar and exploring disabled ships, allowing its crew of three to tractor beam valuables directly on board the rear ramped cargo hold for clearing up any lingering threats or exploring areas inaccessible to the mothership. Further, if the carrier ever comes under fire or as a diversion, the C8X Pisces can undock and escape. For these reasons, using the Pisces for piracy is number five. Number four, cargo. When you need a ship that can deliver the goods in any environment and location, the C8X Pisces is ready to rock. Whether your cargo is boxes, medical supplies, or something atypical, the rear ramp hold makes it easy to load up your goods, so you can jump right into your route. And while 4SCU won't net large profits, it is impressive for a ship of this size, and offers even more functional storage when you ignore those rated limits, and fill the hold to the brim. Further, its low operating costs and inexpensive claim timers means you'll never have to wait even if disaster strikes you en route. For these reasons, and more, using the Pisces for cargo is number four. Number three, transport. Whether you're raiding a bunker and need to duck under the firing arcs of its cannons, or just ferrying folk across Stanton systems, you'll need a reliable vehicle that's capable of transporting both players and their luggage. And the C8X Pisces is more than capable of tackling this task. With a pilot seat, two dedicated jump seats, and an open interior, you have everything you need to bring two friends or paid passengers along to get the job done right. And as a snub craft is conveniently capable of leaving from carriers and landing anywhere you need for the best drop-offs possible. For these reasons, using the Pisces as a transport is number three. Number two, exploration. When out on expedition, why be limited by location? With the C8X Pisces, no matter the obstacles, you've got a ship which can get you to the discoveries. Capable of navigating even the tightest caves or crowded wrecks, the Pisces offers every opportunity to succeed in this profession. As a snub craft, the Pisces has the largest fuel capacities out of any ship in this class. With 522,000 liters of hydrogen, and 645 liters of quantum fuel and has more than double the cargo capacity of every other snub ship combined. This utility, complemented by its jump drive and room for friends, lets you explore anything, anywhere. For these reasons, using the Pisces for exploration is number two. Number one, runabout. Whether exploring the stars or setting your sights on something in particular, the Pisces gives you a platform to do it all. As a convenient runabout or standalone daily driver, the Pisces has three onboard seats, four size one weapons, two size one missiles, a size one shield and quantum drive, and four SCU for players to make the most of. In tandem with its simple, no frills design that handles nimbly in atmospheres and is convenient in every regard. It can be docked inside larger ships, spawned at planetary outposts, and has some of the lowest operating costs out of any ship in game. The C8X Pisces is a vessel that any enterprising captain should strongly 
consider adding to their fleet. For these reasons, using the Pisces as a runabout is number one. But how do you feel about the Pisces? I love the design and convenience it offers, especially when running bunker missions. And I could see this ship being a staple of planetary outposts as the dedicated runabout on site. Do you own one yourself? And what about using it as a starter ship versus the Titan? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And if you liked this video, here's another I think you'd enjoy. Or to watch more of these videos, check out this playlist. Either way, thank you, and I look forward to seeing all of you out there in the verse.